Hey folks, welcome back to Aloft. Got a little more done on the uh, on the flight deck up here. Mm-hmm. Above the command deck down here. Yep. So last time we had all oh, most of this built, I went ahead and made a, a, a an observation deck out here. I guess we'll call it. Doesn't go all the way around just to pop out from here. So when we see that that rock out there. Is that really a rock? Well, let's see here. Yeah, maybe. Yep, okay, they're wiggling on their own. They must be rocks. And Alley Cat wrote in, suggested that I use the spyglass to take a closer look at the map table. And that really lets you zoom in and see things better, including what direction the, the island is going. And that, let's see if I can get any closer that there's actually, well, can't quite tell from here, but there's actually four islands, not three. And that's what got me last time. I did that the last five minutes of last episode in the dark. So it was, it blew me away that I was, come on, let's try flying, that I was, where is it? Right over there coming into the same island that I had been to twice and yet missed all of these landings down below. I thought, that's not possible, but it was dark and you couldn't really see that there's actually another island. Where is it? Oh, he's hiding in the clouds now. Let's see if I can... Boy, the view really goes away. It does. Hmm. Let's... Head over here so I can hit settings. See if I can take the uh, the fog effect away so I can see a little better. Over here, options, graphics, volumetric fog. Let's just take it off completely and see if that helps. There is an island on the other side of the little tornado there. You can kind of see it. I'm, I'm guessing that's what that is there. Oh, there's the one I'm thinking of. Okay, this little guy. So this is where we had been to twice, and I made the comment that that I've already been up on top here. I took the door kick and, and cleaned it off several times, and I haven't hit my timing right yet, have I? There we go. This is what I thought I was going to as I was closing the last episode. And that blew me away that there were all those places down underneath and I hadn't seen it. Though I went around the island completely <laughs> in the middle of last episode. Well, that was a rough landing. Yeah, this is where I thought I was going. Yeah, blueberries. So what that was all about, I don't know. But I think I need a, I need a nap. I also need to realize that we're in that middle ring now and... We're a lot closer to the uh, hurricane than before, and the fog came back. <laughs> Stop that! On, off, no. Uh, cloud render distance very low. Ultra. Whoa, very good. Anyway, yeah, that the hurricane looks entirely different with ultra settings. Yeah. Um, where's home? Right over there. So let's go back to the island that we accidentally visited last time. So this was actually a fourth island. There were the two over there, the one, and I, in the dark I went right past the one and went to another one. Pop down in here real quick. Nope, not that one. I want this landing over here perfect now we had that that one cage or something here that I used the cure on to get rid of but it there was nothing inside of it and I thought that was really odd the chaos wrote in and suggested that I use the door kick on it and see if there's anything hiding underneath nope darn good good try though good uh, good suggestion it it's I don't know, it was really odd that there was nothing there. Kind of a waste of a cure. I'm going to go a little deeper. 
And further over? No. Nothing. I figured this was all the chests that we were going to get, but yeah, that would have been quite the surprise. You know, unexpected surprise. Anyway, so... I was working on this, decided to put the... Get back in the air. Let me hold the brakes on. There we go. Run the observation deck around the top, and then I just kind of kept building. The hardest part was the uh, the stairs. These are quite a trip to put in. And let me, see, let me do something here. You, uh, you are actually this one, right? Right there. I think that's the right one. <clears throat> what I ended up doing was grabbing on up there. Found the right spot. And then grabbed it right there and spun it around. And then it just drops into place. I lost it. There. That doesn't feel right. No. Where are you? There you are. And one more. New. No. Okay, there it is. Yeah. <clears throat> Those were tough to uh, to figure out the first time. I mean, it seems obvious until you realize that there's two different directions and with and without railing and yeah anyway I tore them down 15 times pretty much in fact this whole deck I tore down to uh, redo it and yeah hours long into midnight last night so it's not done yet I mean this big old beast just kind of floating out here so thought I would come up with a support system and make it look more realistic but and I had to f creatively carve out above this because I kept hitting my head and the railings were interesting there's no curves but you can take these guys and step them one eighth of a rotation at a time and gradually work your way around a curve so yeah again a lot of flexibility in the in the construction system I've got <clears throat> quite a few of the sails up in here now I think I've got one of everything except I haven't used the the wool yet we don't have enough to do it so we'll go with these and I'm gonna have to relocate this guy and come up with a better plan for power but I wanted to take a look at those islands one last time before we took off so that we can see the uh, the sails up here and, and kind of get a sense of what's going on so where am I going let's head to port and let's see build more rudders ah I missed a step okay so we still got rudders to put on I did stop right because we're still nope I didn't okay our frames per second dropped big time but they are going back up again good Rudders, <clears throat> I wanted everything in one place. Realistically, you'd probably want them around the perimeter of the island. Rudders at the back, sails on the sides, helm in the front. But on a smaller island, I think that would work pretty good. But on this one, I think one great big deck with everything on it. Like it's like this is the, the power center for the ship. You know, everything you need to make the ship happen is here. So I thought about putting rudders kind of up in this area. And let's spin you around like so. And I'm thinking back over here. Do they clear the railing? Yeah. A rudder there. <clears throat> and a rudder here. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay. So in that case, how do we do it? i got to put two more of these in over there. This guy drops to that far. Let's put Run Rudder right behind. He's not going to swing around and hit this. And for that matter, we could almost put three of them right there, couldn't we? This guy does swing around back behind here. This is the, the sail that goes you know, parallel with the ship instead of perpendicular. Or I guess we could do something like, I don't know, here and here. Maybe. I don't know how the rudders interact with the sails in that sense. So this guy goes away. 
because well it's dark now because I want to put two more of the lift sails up there so let's go do that real quick let me, let me bring the sun back up so we can see what's going on I needed to take a tree down it was in the way and I didn't just do it because at the moment at least there was a big old floating rock laying in that tree and I thought you know this would be cool to show oops one more but then you know I restarted the game and the rock was gone so so much for that let's drop crash right down through that tree okay let's send the tree that direction um, that didn't work well you are colorful what do I want here three yeah see if I can hit it in the back side over there nope missed completely all right you dropping that way yeah there we go didn't no goats were harmed in the filming of this video yeah five six pop you out okay now fly back up there and that wasn't the right tree <laughs> all right we have one less tree down there okay let's try that again where can i drop you let's drop you down that length over there yeah let's see if that works hey, it worked uh oh took out a get back here yeah I almost took out the walls up there one two three four are we good let's do that and let's do that hey there was one more that was not an axe this is an axe <laughs> Sorry. Okay, seven. Let's take those out. All right, so we're clear over here, and now we got room for lift sails. Um, it's a long way up to go this way, but yeah, I did put this in. I like the 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 design of of an what would you call this? An inside curve of a staircase. I used to do this in Minecraft a lot. It just no matter which way you hit it, you just it just flows really well. So that's. The new access point getting up into here. We need to do something similar out the other side. These are a little difficult to get in. You got, There's a lot of mouse movement <laughs> to get around that corner all that time. Um, at least for me, I've got the mouse sensitivity turned down so it's not quite so jittery. Um, what am I doing? I'm putting more of those guys in. So let's build a couple of these. Spin you around. Uh, line you up. Looks like a touch that way. And I think I want just shy of that line. About like that. Another one here to match. About like so. Okay. So we've got lift. This side over here too. <clears throat> yep. We've got rudders. So I don't know if these two are going to be happy. We could rudder even like right here, maybe. That's possible. Spread this stuff out. But let's get back down below and see if everything's happy. There we go. I thought about putting this guy off to one side. I mean, there's a natural place right here for him. To clear my, my center pathway, but haven't decided. I kind of like the symmetry of that. But it is a lot of curving around when you're walking. Okay, so we've got lots of lift. We've got enough rudder. And probably as much sail as we've ever had. Okay, so let's take off and turn. Well, I guess you got to press E first. I did press E. Wait a minute here. I just went like that. That's interesting. I got thrown off the side of the, of the command podium. What do you call the... The, the the ramp here the the yeah this the flat thing I'm standing on okay I want to see if I'm clear there oh, I didn't go forward there we go so forward and that's right I wanted to turn but let's not turn too much just yet make sure our back end clears you can hear the popping and crackling of the torches all right we'll turn around seems like we wanted to head toward those guys over there. Alright, so we're at full sails. Let's check the map. 
Yep, that's pretty good. Check it even closer. Yeah, perfect. And let's hit up top. A little jittery. Where are we at? 13 frames per second. I keep adding more to this island. I may have to eventually take my uh, my settings down. Okay, yeah, these were a little close, so they need to move. But we've got these guys here to help with the wind when it's in that direction. We've got a couple of these guys, a left and a right. We've got the main there and the main there. And I've got the other one of those sails up in here. So I think that works pretty good. Let's move these guys. I don't like how close they are. You go away. Go away. Not much rudder right now. Spin you around. And I think you catch a good wind right there. And right in there. Alright. So I don't know if that made a difference as far as what it registered for rudder. There we go. Rudder. I think it's about the same as where it was. Though sails. You see the difference there? The dark green below and the uh, the light green above. Is that saying that... Wait, that might be our wind potential. Let's spin this thing around and see if that changes as the wind comes back behind. Rather than sail placement. Yeah, as we're coming around, we're catching the, uh, the sails that catch it from the side. Ah, that must be what's going on. If we get full sail... So we get toward the back. I wonder if that's going to max out on me. Not quite. Better. Yeah. Well, we'll keep going around because we are going the other direction, but we are going into the wind. Which made me just stop and think about something. Let's spin around till we've got those back in our view. That must be our group right there. One, two, three. Now, without any more successful, you know, um, uses of the knowledge stones. Yeah, that's looking pretty good there. There's really no point in going to a lot more islands because we're just going to... We'll, we'll click on them to make them green on the map. We're not going to gain anything from them. So, as far as running the whole circle of the rings doesn't make much sense here in the demo but yeah we, we've done a lot in order to see what the game's all about um oh that's what i was thinking yeah these symbols around here do they indicate the direction of the wind on the the wood frame between the the rings are they just design or are they saying the wind's going in that direction because we're heading in that direction, yet the wind is coming from in front of us. Which I thought was odd. Going counterclockwise, you'd think the wind would be coming from behind, if that's what those symbols are. And that's what I had assumed. So the symbols on the inside are going that way too. Look at the, uh, the hurricane there. Oh, I see. The the lens on the spyglass is acting kind of like a kaleidoscope. That's why it looks like they're they're uh, I don't know, contorting as they go around. Yeah, like defective glass. But yeah, I assume that that was a aiming the direction the wind was going. Maybe I am wrong there. Anyway, raining. Let's think about more construction here. And how far do I? can I go before we hit that? We're actually closer than you'd think, and I want to do some things. So let's take this down quite a bit. And speed at this point, we're just going eight. That's because we're going into the wind. Though the wind is starting to shift around on us. Look at that. Yeah. Anyway, let's put glass in. And maybe some support structures and do some things around here was going to do the rest of this last night, but thought, you know, these sort of things would work well recording. I don't have to really stop and 
think about things. I can just do while I'm talking. So any reason to... Where am I at there? Come on. There you are. To put more of these around. I mean, it's, it's an interesting design, but I think just doing the front half kind of gets the point across. Kind of nice to be able to see out here. Now, by building with such a low frames per second, I wonder something I wanted to do on camera as well. If we were to take graphics down to medium, what does that do? Let's see, texture will take you down as well. Now what is off? That's fog. So we'll pull everything down to medium and see resume. Okay, well we were temporarily up in the 40s, but went from 15 to 17. So it doesn't really make a difference at this point. Moving around 14, 13. Okay, so it's not my system bogging down. That's what I was curious about. Okay, so I was thinking about taking some stone. Um, this guy, big block, and head down to that guy. And I think right above this, so somewhere in there, and you're just all over the place. So manual, that's disabled. Oh, that was real, automatic. And you're all over the place. Interesting. So we go to manual, and that at least clicks around. Okay. So is this directly above there? Click. It is, except there's no st stone at that point. It starts here. Okay. So build you. Drop down into there. Put a row of these in. And same thing over here. I think that's the one. So three. Get rid of you. Well, I can leave you. We just won't put the pillar there. Okay. So let's grab a stone pillar. Something like that. Now you, I had to go to full um, disabled in order to work. So if I go to there he continues up until he hits all by himself okay so there and if I were to do that again here so in that case what roll the mouse yeah like that and drop yep he fills it in so if we wanted to make this look like there was a major support system here maybe it's too much All right, what's that look like? Well, it definitely helps support such a mammoth roof. Though we could also do it in... more like this. Um, how would we do that? And where am I at? We're pretty much there. Let's stop the ship for a while. Let's go up and see where we are. Okay, we've got an island there with a tunnel underneath. One over there. There's three of them. And they were kind of in a triangle. Does that mean there's one underneath us? One over there. Oh, there's one that is corrupted. Okay. And that was a strange graph that just passed in front of the, uh, the storm there. I guess that's a cloud. Alright, so there's three that we know of. Let's look a little closer. Are those really three? Yeah, it seems to be. See the green ones here? Well, if I had more light. Uh, you. There. And eight. The green one right there is actually two next to each other. That was the big one and little one right next to each other. It looked like one at the time. So I'm checking to see if there's actually four here. That's what surprised me. You know, there were actually four in that cluster over there, and yeah, I didn't catch that, so that's what surprised me. Let's bring you to a full stop, and I'm gonna go back and bring the sun back so we can continue building here. 
All right, sun's back. Man, the wind blows when you go through a door, even if it's outside. <laughs> okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, they're they're all accounted for. Um, last time we fed them inside, and eventually they figured out how to get there. But when I came back, there were eight of them all piled up in that one square, all on top of each other, and they couldn't figure out how to get back out. So, yeah, we're having a little trouble with getting pheasants through an opening. Hmm. But let's grab these guys and you as well. And that all? Oh. oh, there's a feather. Okay. One of these days I'm going to make more arrows. Alright, you guys are taken care of. I do want to get more wool. So let's go shear and get milk. And poo. Yep, I've had to got to clean up the mess here. Gonna have to get the composter up and running again. I'm, I'm, I'm amassing a lot of poo. I really am. All right, you guys, and I should probably be shearing while I'm at it. Drop you in there, and eight, and looking for a sheep, right there. You will not let me shear you until you've eaten. Can I feed you? I can feed just you. There we go. Oh, you're happy little dude. Okay, got you, Mr. Uh, alpaca. Who? What is the difference between an alpaca and a llama? <laughs> to the uh, untrained, it looks about the same. All right, let's eat. And I'm sure there's there's quite a bit of difference, just like the difference between a uh, an emu and an ostrich. But let's see, let's put you away. Let's grab a bucket right there and eight. And let's find somebody to milk, which is Valerie, who wants to be fed first. So E, there we go. And grab milk from you. And who else do we have? Finley. And we've got, what, a Margaret? Where is Margaret? Here? There you are. Feed you, which puts milk in you and back into my bucket. All right. Now, milk and wool. Now, milk is coming out at, where is it? Right there. Three per. But wool is still only one per. So it's going to be a while before we amass a lot of wool. But milk is pretty easy to get. All right, so that's all of the, the mess over here. Okay, so we've got those. And what were we doing when it was dark? We're working on framing this guy out. Yeah, we could also put in some kind of a oh, support system that looks probably a little more realistic. So let's think about this and move over to this guy where do we want dark let's do dark so we get the contrast so you where to start let's start at about there but just inside like there let's see a little bit of a rotate and if I were to take you out you can only go so far okay so let's how far can I go let's go to there I want to see the lines. Kind of hard to do with all this fog. Yeah, that's going to drive me nuts. Let's see if we can kill the fog again. Um, escape. Options. Right there. Turn you on and off. There isn't a spot where it goes away. Let's go to low. Because I was on low before. And as I ran it for a while... I was able to then turn it off. Let's see. Graphics. I do that now? Nope. Nope. Couldn't cheat it that time. Okay. Reflections aren't a thing. Shadows. That's different. So, no shadows. Now nah, that doesn't really help. Looks better with shadows. There we go. So, take you to there and... We'll just do that. All right, I'll just have to work with it. Um, 
Now is where a scaffolding would be good. If I were to... What I want to do... Nope, I can't see it. Okay. I want to catch underneath this thin part from, I guess, over there. And I want it to be, like, from that point in. So... Oh, the fog went away. No, it came back. <laughs> I know it's a lighting effect. Yeah, let's... I can't go from this direction because I don't know where to start. So I've got to start over here. But I've got to stay in just the right place to make that work. Okay, so build. And you, you. And let's swing over to you. And let's jump up, up here. So it's in that path there. So just shy of that one, which is about like that. And as we head over here, good. The fog is, is gone. So... About like that and right there and then if I just click again will it grip the end for the most part okay when am I gonna fall off the edge of the world here so over and I feel like you've twisted no it's just because I'm bending backwards so how do I get a little closer gotta get up in here there we go so you go to let's see up a little Pretty close to there. Okay. So if I were to do that, that's what I did underneath the house. Over by the by the pond. And then if I grab another one of could almost do the round at this point. Now I could hide that joint by doing that. One thing, the advantage of the round is it can't be twisted out of out of uh, out of place. Now there's a snap point here somewhere. There you are. Boom. That looks pretty good. So another one, probably close to this end, though I'd, I'd bring it in a little bit so it's not too close to the stairs. Could even go here. Now we'll go underneath that support. Grip that. Down. Snaps right there. Like that. Now, how do we deal with it over here without it being right in the walkway? If I do this, we land right there. Actually, that's not too bad. If I grab you and come down, the snap is there. Hmm. Let's move in to that point over there. So, well, I guess the easiest way is just to click and then delete it later. So if we move in to about there, where does that come down? There's the snap. Okay. That won't be that hard to look around it. Okay. Now, as far as it looking even, that is off a bit. I was trying to hide the joint. Would it look weird to have a fourth one there to make it uh, make it look like it's been structurally engineered to look that way on purpose? That works. Okay. So, let's go over here and delete this guy. And... Let's throw, let's see, three. And the only way to, for me to do this is I have to talk to myself while I'm doing it. Yeah, so makes for a, I don't know, good YouTube practice. Um, where am I trying to aim at here? It's right over there. So at that point there, so, no, no, fog, go away, go away. So it's, I guess it's the way the sun is interacting with the clouds. That must be what's going on. But it does make it hard to see in there. Um, that's the right position right to left. I just don't know where I need to be front to back. So somewhere in there. Coming out over here. What I could do is hit the halfway point. I guess that would work. Yeah. So there. And start up again. And... Get up on the roof. Oh, good. I didn't lose it. Over to here. And we're following kind of the center of that, which lands somewhere like that. Though I see I stopped short on the last one. Let's do that. Okay. So now we are... That looks pretty good. Where's my joint? 
Oh, the joint's pretty much hidden this time. Interesting. It formed itself together. Okay. Well, let's just grab the center point here. Take you down, find the snap. And we hit right about... Oh, we went with round. Never mind. You go away. And... Oh, I'll fix that later. Let's go back to this guy and put you in at the halfway point right about there okay where are you there so you are even with this right about like so you're a little bit too far in so let's Click, delete, and move over just a little bit further. Alright, we'll go with that. And then this guy was over here at this point. Okay, you're there somewhere. There. Okay. So there's... I don't know don't know that I really like that. It seemed the best way to support, you know, to show support for this this bridge across here, but eh, I'm not really getting into that. I got different sized poles here. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. It takes quite a while to, you know, I, I deleted a lot last night. Otherwise, what? Um, we've got new islands out here. How close are we to them? Let's go up on this observation deck and see what's going on. So we got that guy down there. He looks interesting. We've got other ones that I've already lost. <laughs> because we kept going forward for a while. Let's move ourselves a little bit more centered to the three. Which means what? Which means swing to port and go forward for a while. Okay. So head into here. And see, you're down where? Can't see you at all through these windows. But I'm thinking we're heading for more like that orientation. And so you're there. You're there. Which means the other one is... So directly to our right, front right, and front left. Front left, front right, and directly to our right. He's over there somewhere. What am I not seeing? You're not below us. Oh, you're back over there. Okay. So that's the one that was corrupted. So let's just, while I have a little bit of light left, don't have a lot. Let's go see what this is. So I'm wondering if we're going to get, now that we're in the middle ring, we're going to get different enemies or different challenges. So this is actually the same uh, island as we've seen twice already. We'll grab these guys. Got two chests in here. And we'll leave the... Uh, the learning stone, the knowledge stone. Maybe in a week or so, more will appear in the game. Don't know. Or maybe this is it until full release. So that no more surprises come out. Let's go bring the sun back and we'll, we'll go and uh, investigate that other island. Okay, that's the one we just went to. The other one is where? The little guy was off to this side. So let's go see what that's about. And quickly... Is that you? No, that's a rock. <laughs> because I think we have a storm coming in. Yeah, it's already getting tough to see. Alright. Well, I'll just hit an updraft or something. There we go. Let's see what this guy's all about. And yes, we will strip mine him. 
Okay, what's all the yellow? Oh, we have we have a challenge over here. Okay. And drop in. What do we have here? So just to get to that. Why am I holding a bucket? I have no idea. But let's go ahead and remove this. Got some great flax there. And we'll leave him because there's nothing more to gain from that. We'll save them. Grab these. And see if there's anything buried down underneath. You are noisy, though. Gotta say that, but... Nice music. I think the prize here was just the knowledge stone. Kinda looking that way. Yep, I think so. Okay. Put it all back together again. Spent years hiking. The motto is to... Leave it at least as good as you found it. Yeah. Okay, what else is on this island? Nothing that way. Let's see what's down below here. We got some wheat. Great. That's not a scythe. Sickle? Scythe. Maybe. <laughs> okay, and grab what was hiding in there. And one of you, you're just a tr regular tree. Is there something below us now? There's one more little shelf here. Oh, a little more of you guys. Hardly have to harvest any of my own. There's enough else out there. And you are just the pathway back up. Okay, that's that one. Let's, I'll take you guys though, thank you. Let's go to that corrupted island and see what is over there. Looks pretty good from up here. Mm-hmm. Let's head down. Land over here. Um, wonder if I can land on my... Slow it down. Up a touch. And drop. Cool. Alright, so we are heading this way. Let's see if I can get this thing to come into view. It's right over there somewhere. And I think it was below us... Let's drop down a bit. Otherwise, I'm not sure. Swing back. Stop dropping. And... Not you. Aren't you over here? Hard to see through the clouds. What is that right there? I think that's it. I think so. I think that's the... Uh, We'll call the smog around the outside of the island there. Let's head to that and see what we get. And... Where was that now? There you are. So, we need to rise a little bit. Okay, doing 30 knots. That's pretty good. Without a storm, too. Am I still rising? I am, so let's slow that down. Is there anything there? I look at it from the edge. There it is. It just disappears when you're looking straight at it. I wonder what causes that. I wonder if that's something that can be fixed, or is that just the, the nature of this game engine? Still not spawning in yet. Hmm can't quite see what's right in front of me with that deck there. Yeah. Anyway, let's take you down, slow you down, and let's bring him into view this way. Yeah, we're pretty close. Alright, all stop. All stop. So, I guess we could just head straight over. I've got a pumpkin pie on me. Yeah, that's just basic basic uh, supplies. You just naturally just keep a pumpkin pie on you. You, and we'll even add a smoothie to that one. Mmm. A couple of drinks, get that, that uh, stamina moving up quicker. And sword in hand. 
And let's do this. Up a little higher. Slow it down. Let's get high enough that it doesn't fog over on me. And let's see what's going on. Do we play with the bottom levels first or start at the top? Let's head into... I've got a bad guy there, a bad guy there. I've got four, five bad guys on this level alone. Wow. Okay, let's clear off the very top first. It's going to get dark on me, isn't it? It's probably late afternoon. Let's drop in. Got Boom Booms there. Somebody woke up. Hello. Okay, you're too far away. Over here. You're about to explode. Okay. Let's take you out. Boom. Boom. Okay, it just knocked you aside. It didn't actually... Nope, it did take you out. And unfortunately, it means I don't get the uh, the benefit there. So let's get you going. All right, took you out. Got four cleansed samples. I don't remember it being called cleansed before. Okay, so, oh, I hadn't thought about that. Are there different um, results? Whatever you call them, you know, what you, what you get from them based on the ring that you're in. I don't know. Um, I guess I want to fly over there. Okay, let's wake you up. Boom. Yeah, I cannot do those, those, uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm falling, okay, let's see if we can't get up here and do something, where are you at, you're all over there, don't fall off, okay, let's drop into here, combos, that's the word I was trying to come up with, okay, we got one there, we got one there, so, no one's coming at me? Now, let's review Encyclopedia. So a leap is hold and release. But I can couple that with a space bar. Hold. Release didn't work. I just flew. Okay. Hold. You guys are really angry, aren't you? Yeah. Over here. And I don't even have my sword on me anymore. Okay, let's go over, up a little, bring you guys over this way, following me, and then we will drop down over here and hit one. Alright, try that again. Where'd you go? You didn't fall off, did you? No. Really? Maybe you buried yourself back in. Alright, hold, and boom. Destroy the nodes. Was I holding the axe when it didn't work? Maybe that was it. Oops. Got a boom boom. Okay. Get you. And let go space. Boom 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 boom. Alright. I successfully hit a bunch of keys. That one worked. So. What did I actually do? I held. I walked over. I let go in space and then boom 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 okay just keep repeating that where'd the other ones go that were on here that was a shame didn't want to lose them I want to get as many but no as many of those samples as I can get we got 16 so far and my weapon is fully charged still okay and we're gonna be dark soon so I'm fully willing to do this in under over the span of a couple of days rather than doing it in the dark. I am not seeing anything up in here, so let's take off and hit another level. Alright, we've got an exploder right there. Drop into here. And if I set you off, what is your radius? Do you you don't affect that guy. Okay. So, over here. Drop. Weapon. Anything up in here? We've been here before. I think we started here. So, 
What is left then? I think I've got some enemies right down in here. Just landed on a boom boom now. Okay, hit you. Oh, got you. Those are blowing up. I saw someone in the ground right here. Alright, boom. Oh, that was interesting. Okay. Alright, with that, let's go ahead and start taking some of these down then. There. Charge. Point. Well, I didn't hit it right, but I still managed to take him out. Okay. Got more goodies there. Let's take this one down. Oh, hello. Alright, got that one right. Take you out. And gain another six. Cleansed. So... It looks like a similar shape. I, I won't know till I get back to the research table. So, where am I heading now? Hearing noises down there. Let's just drop in and say hi and see what answers you. Alright, charge up. Head over. Alright, let's see if I get this right. Let go space and then hit a bunch of these. No! Let's move over here. Where are you at? There you are. Got a mushroom in the way. Maybe that's a problem. Will you go blue on me? You will not. Why won't you go blue on me? Huh! I guess because there's something in between us? Holding? Nothing. Am I out of charge? Not out of charge, but I'm halfway. Alright, let's just go take you... Are you are you real? Yeah. Take you out the old fashioned way. Okay. So what else is on this level? No nodes over there. Over here. I'm I'm, I'm hearing things. Oh, hello. I'm walking into things. <laughs> okay, holding boom. All right. There was a combination of buttons that didn't work. Yeah, combos. I don't know. You fell, didn't you? I think I have probably a few of them down here waiting for me, huh? Hmm. Oh, and you too. Okay. Are you going to fall down to me? You probably are. No? Okay, well, I'm sure I've got a few others down here. No? No? Let's go up in here. If I can get over there. Well, we'll do it this way. So what's... Who's walking around up here? Hmm. Let's go through here. And drop in from this side? No, that doesn't help. I have a feeling it's going to get dark before I finish this one. Yep, boom booms. I'll take oh, two of you. Let's get down on the ground so I can do this right. There we go. Boom, space. The space throws me up so far, but it doesn't keep him in front of me. So that's not really the answer. So I'm doing that one wrong. What else do we have? I need practice. Who's out here? I'm going to have to switch over to the door kip soon just to... Uh, oh, hello. Two of you. All right. Boom, 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 boom. Now, I did that one right, but I have no idea why. <laughs> yeah, or I just do that and hit really hard. Not, not hit any other keys. That's the easiest one. Just hold it and let go. All right. What else is around this perimeter? Nothing here. Yeah, we're dark now. But thankfully, the whole place didn't just go black on me. It tends to do that. Unless it's just because you're next to a node. Yeah, it seems to be behaving. Okay. Um, down to the end. Let's do this guy. Alright, so... Okay. Just one? Just one. 
And I've still got some glue on there. Alright, so I got those, and I think I'm out of glowy stuff on my on my sword. Alright. I guess, well, the lightning's gonna let me do this, so I'll go ahead and finish the job. Nope, oh, there it went black. So what happened? Let's get back on here. Come on, go. And now the lighting's okay still. Alright, so let's look around, see what else there is to destroy. See if we can get any more samples out of this. Don't want to just end it. I want to get as much out of this as I can. Though there are no combos with this tool, so this is just a, a hack em slash em. So nothing here. Let's go up a little higher. <clears throat> or fall. Okay. Oh. Noises. Yeah, not good off. More noises. Where are you at? Alright, what's in here? And I can't cut through this stuff. Okay. Let's jump, jump. Nope. Doesn't gonna doesn't let me do that. So let's go out here and try that. Up. There we go. So down inside there is gonna be rough while the island is still infected. So let's get over here and finish off this node. Or at least wander around and see if there's anything else that I may have missed. But I'm not seeing any. Not seeing any red caps. Though down there. No, don't think so. Alright, let's land right here. Uh, three. Get rid of you. Six. Nobody else? Don't think so. Alright. That. Oh, the charge does work. Yeah, I'm cornered. Okay, I guess I was wrong. There is at least something with the door kip. I thought that the, well, I guess the, the animation for doing you know three or four in a row perfectly is what doesn't exist yet. I guess what it was that I heard. Okay, so oh, I ran out of potion on that one too. Okay, so what did we end up getting? We've got 55 of them, and we're full of cleansed and three of injured. Okay, anything fall? Any bags? Because I ran out of room. Okay, let's head back, bring the sun back, wherever back is. There's back. Alright, let's go see what it was that we actually found. Nope. Didn't get into here. Okay. So, what that was, I don't know. This is just milk and the other, so it's not like we actually need those things. Alright, we'll drop them all off in here. So you are... You are that. This one is different. It really is. but I don't get the sense of it meaning anything. So maybe that is just for next time. Maybe the coming soon really is coming soon. Okay, so we'll just drop all these off for now and use them later. Um, keep you. And let's just go make a little bit of room, head back to that island, see if there's anything left to clean up on it, and then we will call this an episode. That is a good sized island. Now the one over there looks dark. I know we... I, I assume we've been there. Yeah, that's one of the other ones and they're not corrupted but... Actually, well, that, from this angle it does look like it's corrupted though. I think it's because there's a, uh, a whirlwind in between. Anyways, let's see what we've got out here. You, bones. We've got somebody that needs a cure, and I should have brought more cures. Um, do that, and can I feed? I don't have feed on me. 
another baby one. Here are you. Okay. Um, knowledge stone in the background. What else do we have? Let's head up to this one. Another knowledge stone. It's quite the island. Alright, so any unknown plants? No, a couple more cocoons though. Bones. Uh, didn't mean to click that. And... There's something there, I can't see it. Pick up a baby pheasant. Yeah, I've got to cure you, Cooper. And can I... Oh, wait. Pet? Maybe you got a pet before you can feed? No, I sure thought I had green on me. I do. I guess you already are fed. That's right. We discovered that last time. When it's on your own island, you got to feed them. Okay, cure you, Brianna. Okay, but on these islands, it skips that step. Okay, grab these guys. Any more in here? No. Okay, so we started here? I think we did. Let's see what's down below. Actually, I don't know now. We started over here. Because it got a goat over there. Uh, seven. Grab all of these. Hmm. So, on this island, where would you think there'd be a hidden treasure? <laughs> to me, there are too many possibilities. Alright, looking around. So we've been up there. We've been to this level all the way around. Pretty sure we have. We've got down there to go. We've got down here to go. Looking for anything unusual. Before we drop down all the way. A lot of red over here. Blueberries. Mm. Got more levels below us. And you are just the upper ring. Okay. So down in here, got flax. shelf down there. Nothing from underneath. Uh, where's the blueberries over there? Okay, so let's go down inside. Into the water. Now, there's no use in this in water, right? No. Okay. So that's not a thing. So here and here, a third stone! Wow. Now, we'll go out this other direction. Let's see what's over here. Kind of. Yeah. Can I leap from here? There we go. Grab you and you. And clear off these guys. Sugar cane, and just, I guess out of curiosity, though, I would think the the sugar cane was the uh, surprise here. Carrots. searching for the elusive stone treasure chest now. Huh. Like this hillside right here. No. Okay. Alright, well, we'll take a look around here. Up, slow down. And let's just see this place. Got 
this island over here. Let's head up. Nice and high. What do you think on this one? This one doesn't have a knowledge stone like those two do. Hmm. I think I'm going to take a closer look at what's over here. Let's clear these guys off, get to where we can see what's down below. Okay. With that, let's go ahead and clear off the, the plants. Nope, these plants don't come off. Okay. Do you have the pumpkins there? So... If we were to just peek around up in here. Not a thing. Okay. Yep. I'm striking out. Alright. Well, let's land down in here. And I think call this one done. Yeah. Well, this one felt like it was kind of a... A rambling episode but I guess it is you know part of my my name so I guess that works uh, there it is right off the end over there from here that does look like another corrupted island interesting I wonder if we saw this one from this side from a distance and didn't see that there was another one behind them maybe that's what's going on Okay, well, possibly next time we'll go see what's what's happening over there. But as you can see, the clouds have already hidden it. Makes it hard. Yeah. So, catch you guys later. Bye-bye now.